Hello everyone, this video is my Rage 2 walkthrough part 1. I wasn't originally planning to play through this one, but I was lucky enough to get hooked up with a code, so I thought why not, we might as well check it out. It was a very long time ago that we played through Rage 1, I don't really remember the story too well, although I heard that it doesn't really tie into this game all that much. I did have sort of a reminder on a video that I watched recently, so hopefully that's jogged my memory enough so that I can carry on with this and not be too confused. Let me know what you think about the game in the comment section if you can. Cheers for tuning in, I really do appreciate you being here. Let's get this going. We had such plans for this world. Our Earth so mercifully cleansed by the media they named Apophis. We had such plans, all thwarted by one man, Nicholas Rain. With the push of a button, our future was ended. The arcs emerged. The eco-pods came tumbling down, all premature, pouring life back into the barren lands, starting a cycle of life anew as we had planned to do with our own species. Our plans were thwarted by the naive and arrogant masses. The cleansing of our weakened species was hindered. Our aid selfishly refused. They chose their own pitiful existence over the future of the breed. Such hubris. They thought us defeated. We let them believe us defeated. But we moved underground. We watched their petty squabbles, their meaningless turf wars, their childish attempts at order from chaos, and we grew strong. Our science, our expertise, all aligned, all with one sole purpose. The surgical culling of the weak. Man reborn! We tear down the defenses. We take their compounds. We take the arcs. We raise their settlements and townships to the ground. Tonight marks the beginning of the cleansing. Tonight marks the rebirth of the authority! Nothing good. Better gear up and move out. Hmm. So, I can play as male or female? This is a first person game, so I'm guessing I don't have to look at an ass for the entire it's a drill. way through the it game. So, I'm gonna go with a dude. Like it's go time, right? Yeah. Let's get grab it. Your gear. Grab your gear. Alright, so hopefully, decent frame rates, good performance. If you hear my keyboard clacking a little bit, I apologize. I've done my best to try and. Um. Make it so that that isn't a thing. Cool. And uh, I'll do some tests to see how my frame rates are and stuff like that. I only really need to play in 60 because that's all YouTube can handle. So as long as I'm maintaining above 60, it shouldn't make a difference to what you guys are seeing, which is what's important really to me. Oh, come on, Lily. That was my kill. <laughs> you gotta move a little faster, Walker. Lily. Closest thing I ever had to family. We grew up here in Vineland, raised by her drill sergeant of a mother. Me? I'm an orphan. I don't have a mother. But there's plenty more where that came from. I'm telling you, this is the big one. All right. Well, let's go fucking get some. Hell yeah, brother. Come on. All right. So I need to figure out keybinds, so like I have no idea. What anything is, but I guess you know, right click's gonna be aim, left click's gonna be shoot. God damn. Ooh. Not at all. Gonna be hard to keep score. I was never much for count count. Okay, see his crouch. I like that. We need you in the courtyard. We're on our way. Got Lily too. Jersey's been deployed to warn the other 
settlements. They gotta know. I guess this is big then. Just snapped it on the comm box. This is the biggest attack they've ever seen. Okay, fell tri cells. Pick up fell tri cells from four line enemies. Uh, four line. Four line enemies to regenerate health. Keep in mind that fell tri cells are highly unstable, though and will dissolve if not picked up quickly enough. Okay, so you need to be quick I'm with serious. that. Then let's go. So I just us a glory ribbon. Before we uh go anywhere, do I have any different weapons? I'm no. Expecting us at the courtyard. That's where the fighting is thickest. So if you've taken a lot of damage, use a health infusion to regain vitality. So it's T to do that. Okay, that sounds good. I think I'm okay, but I mean I can take this at least. Before we carry on, let me go into my settings, key bindings, heal, and just change my sprint. Uh, here we go. I just want to change this to my mouse button if it will let me. Yeah, there we go. I like to put that on one of my mouse buttons. I got 12 on this mouse, so I'll be doing a little bit of that as we go along. Definitely a big one. It's a ranger. Not just any ranger. That's Jersey. He's an angry man. Holy shit! Oh. It took his whole head off. He didn't last very long. He's not gonna defib out of that. Yeah, he's done. Put on the ranger armor. Yoink! <laughs> You just lost five dollars. Shit, mom's gonna skin you alive messing with ranger gear. Uh, but it's still got a lot of jersey in it. Yeah, but it's our only shot. Slap it on, gear up, uh, let's go. Yeah, this is even better than I thought. Ooh, shiny. Cheers, mate. Nice, nice. Lily, I need you in the garage. Walker, get your ass to the courtyard. En route. On my way. Switch weapons. Tap Q to quickly switch between recently used weapons. Hold Q to access the, access the full loadout. Is it like a weapon wheel? Sweet. Okay, nice. That's going to be very useful. Something to bear in mind. Let's take whatever this is. Let's go murder some things. The wing stack is a versatile and deadly gadget that can be used in combination with your other weapons. Press G to tap. tap. Okay, what is it? It's a grenade, basically. What? Oh! I'm gonna have me some fun. I feel like I might put this on a more convenient key, maybe on a mouse button. Oh, sick. I'm taking damage here. I think I might be. Off my friends. F is melee, okay, that's good. Good to know. So I've been making a push to learn mouse and keyboard. If you've been with me a while, you'll know that I've been a controller player for a long time. Uh, but, you know, gotta make the change at some point. Grenades. Use grenades to deal massive damage and even take out multiple hostiles that are huddled together. Uh, tap G to throw a grenade, hold G to switch. Isn't G for my. Oh, I've got to switch the gadget. Okay, so it's X to switch gadgets. So I've got wings. To, oh, I've got a limited amount of those. Okay, cool. Did not know this. I guess I'm supposed to use a grenade. Cooking it. Oh, I like that. Look at that meat. It's pretty clever. I could do with healing. Ooh. Die. Oh, they're pretty tough, man. Is it shooting out of the thing on its back? Oh, excuse me, mate. I need, I need to shot you in the back of the head. You out of that armor as long as she could. Wonder why. Getting jealous, Lily? Damn right I am. I would have been the youngest ranger to ever get sworn in if not for this bullshit nano trike crap. Yeah, none of that, mate. Hold control to focus and highlight enemies and objects of tactical importance. Using focus also attracts a nearby fell try to you. Okay. Again, this seems like something I could put on the mouse. Lots of buttons at my disposal, you know what I mean? But I'll try to do that in between parts. I'll deal with it for now and then once I figure out what exactly the deal is, I'll play with it and uh, try to get things sorted. But that looks like something 
but I could definitely change. Those awkward keys for me, I like to just put on my mouse, man. Rip. See if my headshots do massive damage. Yeah, I'm killing things, man. Give me a sec. So I take it, what it was these little blue things are those little health boosts it was talking about? Useful, useful. I like the slide there. I feel like I should get um the wing sticks out, they were fun. Oh, rip. So I get those back, right? Do they like only have a certain amount of um uses or something? Do you remember what they told us at the academy about the ranger armors? You can overdrive when it's charged. Cut your enemies to pieces. Let's do some of that then. Uh kill enemies in succession to charge overdrive when increased. Uh, which increases the damage you deal when fully charged. You can activate overdrive by pressing V. While using overdrive, you will also gain health. Cool. So, V do that one. Damn. Let's go melee some people. That really make a difference. Alright, sweet. So, I had a kill count on the screen for a second there. I need to, oh god, I need to up my aim down sight sensitivity for sure. I feel like I could use a shotgun for these enemies. Hit off. Spray and pray, baby. It's all stuff you need to figure out as you play, you know what I mean? I try to get a little bit of gameplay here rather than spending loads of time in the menus, you know? It's probably what some of you came here for, man. Just to check the game out. Okay, so the game has a few different difficulties, I'm playing just on normal at the moment to sort of feel the game out, but if you're feeling brave, there's hard and nightmare mode as well. Maybe we can up the difficulty in the menus by check it out as we go on, you know? Get the wounded out of the hot zone! Woo! The wall gun is running dry! Bringing ammo! Go, go, go! You, get me a sit rep on Ranger Jersey! Dear old Aunt Prowley. Decorated war hero, ranger, and role model. Especially for Lily. She took me in when my parents died. <laughs> the meanest mom this orphan wildcard never asked for. Reporting for duty! Come here! I'll be here. How much more here can I get? That's Jersey's armor. Jersey. They killed him. You're brave enough to put on his armor. You're brave enough to do his job. What the fuck is that? Never seen anything so big. Makes an easy target. Can't be. He should be dead. General Cross. Wow, he just ripped that dude's arm off and beat someone to death with it. Jesus. I want the first genus. Kill everything else. General Cross, the evil leader of the evil authority. Our own boogeyman. A bedtime story for naughty kids like me. I don't know if Prowley has lost it or if it's really true. You know this, though. If it is, I'm not going to stand for it. Son of a... Stand down. That's a direct order. All right. Chill out. Watch out. Yo. <laughs> Oh god. Oh, A good save. Crowley, is that you? I was set to spare the lives of you original archists for experimentation. But for you, I'll make an exception for old times, Elwina. 
After all, your uselessness is what once spared my life. Oh, Rowley. Uh, we barely knew you. <laughs> Jesus. How am I supposed to become emotionally attached to the characters if you kill them all so fast? Let's see if we can jumpstart this. Clear. Wait, wait the fuck? Fuck's sake. Oh, I was conscious. Yeah, you were. But your shiny new armor needed a jolt. So this is it then. This is all that's left. Just over 20 survivors. We're still digging out the ruins. I saw Prowley. It was General Cross. He... He killed her. He killed my mother. I don't know how. But we gotta stop him. And I'll personally wring the neck of that goddamn wrinkled bastard. What? Great lip syncing. Well, they did. And we gotta do something about it. Thank God for subtitles. Mom knew what to do. The Rangers knew. Wait a minute. They kept their files, the logs. They kept them in the Presidio. The Ranger CP? You nuts. Only Rangers can go in there. Look at me, Lily. <laughs> I'm the only Ranger left. Holy shit. You really are. I've been at this job for a total of 17 minutes. Uh, alright. So, that's, I guess that's the opening done. We got an, uh, an entry on Prowley. Okay, if you would like to read this, I will show it to you so you can pause it and have a read. I have to pause it. Let's have a look at them uh, key bindings really quick. Okay, so happy with that. Interacts. I, I kind of like to have that on F, and I might put melee on a mouse button. So I'm going to put interact on F, and it'll obviously tell me about that. Melee is just beneath it, but I'll put this on um, my third mouse button, which is where I usually have it. That's all fine. Switch weapons is fine. Use support item. I could always put that on uh, two, just like grenades and stuff, and switch support item. That can stay. Um, yeah, I might put that on another mouse button. I got twelve to work with, which is fine. This is this can go on mouse button number five. I can keep these, so I might put that one on T, just so, uh, and I'll keep this on X as well, just in case I do forget which mouse button I have, which I'll probably do at some point. For now, I'll leave it at that. Just so I've got a couple of things in some cheeky places. I'll try to experiment and play around and just try to remember what I've bound to what. I dare say I'll be forgetting along the way, but I'm probably going to be playing this game for a little while, so I'll figure it out. Also seeing some screen tearing. Let me know if you see that on your end. I don't think you're going to see that, though. Because usually when I record stuff and I see screen tearing, it doesn't show up on the recording, which is good to us. So um, I'm full on assault rifle rounds, I think. Oh, it's F now, isn't it? I changed it to F. Duh. Duh. Right, moving on. It's me still pressing F, but I could also put something on E. Because I'm not using that key now. kind of like to put more important stuff on E. You know what we could do? When you're playing PC games, it's kind of important stuff, and I'm sorry if this stuff is boring. I will get this figured out. We won't have to mess with it too much. I could put use support item on E and that'll be um, like grenades and stuff I think it's a good idea try not to spend too much time doing that in that first part so I am I do apologize scan me up yeah let me add up wall rat unit corporal walker I'm here to find information about, uh, 
about my... Uh, about Ranger Unit Sergeant Erwina Prowley. Oh, give it to me. <laughs> Which way to that? Kind of surprise you got for me here, Ghost Brawley. Okay. Just get in there. Arcs are extremely valuable and contain both arc weapons and nanotrite abilities. Search for arcs across the wasteland to become more powerful. Approach the arc, face the door, and use focus by holding control to open it. Okay, oh yeah, that was something I wanted to rebind as well, wasn't it? Please approach for security scanning. Security scanning complete. Let's do this first Welcome so we can see this. Arc 401A. 401A. So no. I just stick my hand into this strange hole and hope for the best. Okay. There goes nothing. Oh. Welcome to the simulation chamber. In here, you will be able to gain proficiency in the use of your arc weapons and any ID accessions. You have successfully installed ID accession dash. With the dash accession, you will be able to evade incoming threats and become harder to hit. Okay, as a ranger, the nanotrites inside you give you special abilities. The nanotrite abilities are activi activated by using control. Okay, I'm probably going to rebind that, not going to lie. Tap control to dash in any chosen uh, direction. W, A, S, and D to dodge incoming attacks and throw off your enemy's aim. Alright. Good. Cool. Again, please. And again. Good work. A simulation will allow you to train in the use of your dash accession to evade enemy fire. I mean, that sounds good. Can I quickly rebind? Yeah, let me rebind this because I don't like that button being uncontrolled. It's kind of awkward for me. I feel like there's a much better place I could put stuff. So let's find where that is. There's a lot of stuff. We'll keep... If we change the primary to a button I like and then put that there, it should, when it, when it gives me tutorials, instead of saying control, it should say that button. So this is way more convenient for me. Okay, simple enough. GG. GG, man. Noish. Good. You have successfully completed your dash accession training. Cool. Done and done. We completed a tutorial. Really have to eat my arm? Come back to the main hall. I have more information for you. It feels weird taking instructions from my dead hands. Deal with it. Come on, let me use dash in here. Please. Designed to put an end to the authority permanently. We knew it wasn't likely that they 
just disappear despite their losses. And furthermore, we knew that General Cross was in possession of technology that allowed him something akin to eternal life. Project Dagger was scrubbed when Vineland closed its gates to outsiders. But a pact of sorts remained between me and the other three original Daggers. First, John Marshall of Gun Barrel. A tough, no-nonsense old war horse who led the first fight against the Authority. He understands the importance of technology and spycraft better than anyone. His skills will help keep you off the Authority's radar. Second, Luce of Hagar of Wellspring. Daughter of war hero Dan Hagar. She went from guerrilla fighter to mayor of the greatest city in the wasteland. Her access to military-grade vehicles will be indispensable. And then, there's Dr. Anton Kvasir. Ex-authority scientist turned resistance fighter. He's a genius when it comes to nanotrite technology and mutations. His skills are a cornerstone of the Dagger Project. You will want to know more, Jess Brooke. Your Ranger Armor CPU has logs that will be able to answer many of your questions. Good luck out there, Ranger Walker. Okay. What have you realized to get Project Dagger operational? Damn it. Right. So you thought you'd just dump all that on my shoulders and waltz off into oblivion, huh, Aunt Prowley? Well then, I guess it's all up to me now. Yup, yup. Let's get out of here then. Go talk to Lily. Can't use Dash still. Lily, there are three people I need to find. John Marshall, Dr. Kvasir, and Lucem Hagar. They're all part of a Project Dagger designed to stop the Authority. That's a pretty tall order. Yeah, your mother is no nonsense, even from the afterlife. Too soon, Walker. Sorry, Lily. But, hey, I'm ready to trek out into the wasteland. I think I got just the thing. Come see me. I'm here. So, what you got? Well, I've got lots of ideas for projects, and with your help, we can get them off the ground. They're gonna be key to your survival out there. So. Let's get you your ride. Get me my ride. Welcome to the project screen. Here you are able to purchase projects using project points that you have earned. Projects give a large variety of benefits. At the moment, you only have access to these basic projects. So let's head over there, all right? Okay, so just this one. First project that you can purchase unlocks the vehicles menu. It will also reward you with your very own combat vehicle, the Phoenix. The vehicle's menu gives you access to vehicle upgrades and allows you to call in a vehicle whenever you need one. Nice. Go ahead and purchase it now by selecting it and holding F. All right. Fantastic. You've unlocked the vehicle's menu. It can be accessed through the menu by pressing Tab to a lot more projects, gain project points by completing locations and activities in the wasteland. Okay, cool. So... Okay. If I press Tab then... That's not. Is it, do I need to go to prod? No, vehicles, maybe. Not enough cash. I need ten dollars. Oh god. All right, I got the money. Phoenix is good to go. There are more projects here that would benefit the two of us. You need to beef yourself up, and I need to get Vineland into some semblance of order. So the car's over there. All right, got sweet. So. Can we just get out of here now? Welcome to the wasteland. You can use the map menu tab to locate and track things that you can do in the open world. As we explore, more things you can do will be added to the map. Tracking a location on the map will track it under you with your GPS. The GPS shows you the fastest routes there while driving. There are unlocked missions and arcs you can track now in the map. Okay, cool. Or map menu. All right. So, and the map's pretty big then. Damn, it's huge. For now, I guess that's just the stuff that's like revealed to us right now. So should we go to this arc? How do we set a waypoint, enter, or right mouse button? Now, oh, dude, there we go. Let's hop in the car. Let's get going, man. Well, look Ready. at you. A fresh ranger. I'm Phoenix. I know I look good, but I drive better. Let's you and me go for a spin. The car talks to us. Okay. The space is handbrake. All right, cool. Well, this thing handles quite nicely, to be honest. Also, that GPS is pretty sexy, not gonna lie. Alright, let's go. We've got some greenery in the world. Trader, roaming. 
found roaming the roads of the wasteland, the Roma trader offers a large variety of goods that you can buy from. You can also sell your junk to them for profit. Honk your horn to get the trader to pull over and open shop. I mean, I would, but I don't have any money, right? Stop it. Frame rate's holding up too, so I'm quite happy about that. But for now, we'll just keep going because I don't really have any money, so I'm guessing I'm not going to be able to do anything with that. Someone over there. Sweet guns. Can we do donuts somehow? No. I'll just go then. Alright. What's up, bitches? Oh, it just locks on. It's man -made. You can ambush. Die. Yep. You should see if you can clear that clog up. Who else wants it? Road chokers as a, a trade coalition roadblocks that have been taken over. Clear the out outpost and raise the blockers. Alright, so I've got to get out, I guess. Let's go. Good luck out there. Who am I killing? Oh, he did. <laughs> she said, hey, you guys. I'm blow those barrels up. That's what I'm concerned about right now. Boom. There's another one right there. I'm trying to shoot. There we go, baby. So, what button did I bind um, melee to? I think it was three, right? She caught it and chucked it back. Wow, that was cheeky. Come here. Ooh. Don't you chuck all those nades at me. That's cheating. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong buttons, man. <laughs> Gotta learn sometime, right? So it's, uh, yeah, okay, I'm learning, I'm learning. Die. Hey, we did it. Gotta learn sometime. Gonna be a bit of a noob for a while. It's the one thing that's a lot different for me with PC when it comes to PC and stuff. Um... And we did it, so we raised the road choke. A hundred dollars, oh! Nice. That's a little bit of XP for us. We got a level one there, beautiful. Yeah, learning keybinds is what I was getting at. You have earned a project point. You can use these put to purchase projects, which will benefit you in the as all aspects of the game. Go to menu, press tab, and select the projects tab to see what's available. Let's have a look. So I take it these are like upgrades, right? Um, enter the projects. So what's this one? Unlock the vehicle, what's this one? Increase the cap for the overdrive multiplayer to 10 times to enable more overdrive and feltrite cells to be generated from kills. Oh, that's cool. Why not? I remapped that, didn't I? To, I think it was... Days are over. All clear. Yeah, it's not control, I can still use control. <laughs> didn't I put that on something else as well? No, well. no full damage there. I'm going to keep fiddling with all my buttons. Oh god, I want to blow up my own car. <laughs> I get that switch. Sweet. Alright, I'm getting there, man. I'm getting there. Let's go. Gotcha, Is that an enemy? No, it's friendly. Why won't it let me boost? Die! <laughs> trying to get to this arc, arc to be honest. I thought space was my boost. Is it shift my boost? Oh, okay, it's shift my boost. Space is handbrake. A nice little boost there. Ugh. Ugh. It's one way to take down trees. I guess I've got to be on the lookout for supplies since I've just wasted a bunch. Chucking grenade. Oh god, no. Oh uh, god. <sighs> well. Can we just like climb up mountains with this thing? Can we go skyrimming? Let's go skyrimming. Yeah, Dr. mate. Is still out there, and we have to find Get up there. My armor's lighting up. Connected to some signal close by. It's arc tip, right? Hey. Yep, it's designed hey. to pick these old signals up. It could be an old arc. If it's untampered with, it might still have weapons and gear inside. You should really check it out. Alright. Don't hate me guys, I'm learning. One thing I haven't really done a lot of 
on PC in game, just drive. We're here, sport. But we made it anyway. Proud of myself, man. Progress. Standby mode initiated. Who are these fools? Reloading, give me a sec. Hello. Ah, oh, wrong button. Eh. How many of those things have I got? Two? Oh. Do they always. Oh shit, explosives. Do they always come back to you? Die. Oh, look at that. Oh, hit me in the face with a bat. That's not cool, bro. She didn't like it. I need to reload. Give me a sec, love. Give me a sec. Ooh. Rip. I've got here one of these things. Can't take them? Okay. She's got a shotgun. Can I have your shotgun, mate? No armor for you. Alright, why don't we take it? Hmm. There's a guy over there, apparently. Got my overdrive, but I really don't think I need to use it right now. Get that health back. Okay. Now well, we're here. Open up. Security scanning complete. Welcome to Arc 416A. And we're in. And give me some more powers, baby. You have successfully installed ID accession Shatter. The Shatter accession is a forward lunge that unleashes a powerful kinetic force capable of stripping armor and displacing enemies and objects. Okay. Hold control and press F to lunge forward and unleash a powerful kinetic shatter that damages armor and displaces enemy objects. So if I hold seven, will that still be the same thing? Oh, sweet. It is. Again. Ooh. This is where the game gets a lot more fun, I'm guessing. Good. Easy Shatter enough. To strip the target's armor. Okay. Then we punch him in the face. Oh, I wanted to punch him in the face, but let me. Good night. You have successfully completed your Shatter Accession training. Easy enough. Sweet. Done and done. Hundred and twenty two dollars. I did stuff for this guy apparently. So is that gonna give me stuff to do in his projects or whatever like I don't know if it's a different tree let me see no I got a, I think I've got to meet him first by the looks of it no I can't get to it I think I've yeah I've got to meet him hey, first by the that arc was brimming with some amazing uh, abilities and weapons found in arcs can be upgraded to upgrade your abilities and weapons you can find nanobite nanobite boosters and weapon core mods in arc chests and shops. You can use these upgrades items in the tap menu. Alright, sweet. Here. Yeah, I know. I'm pretty jealous right now, so keep a lid on it, will ya? Let's go, I'm gonna hit one of you with this shit. Oh my god. Get right. Punch me right back. Get away from that. Oh god, it hit me anyway. Should we go for it with the uh, overdrive? Wow, we like picked up off the ground. Oh, missed. And they're just chucking nades. I haven't got any. Um... Oh, God. 
hit this guy with this thing, don't I? Boom, no armor for you, motherfucker. Oh, no face. Let's reload. I don't think I have any health. Nope. He just went to baseball bat at me. <laughs> he killed your own friend. Oh, uh, that's funny. Okay. We done here? Where's my car at, son? I'd rather leave the Phoenix. Ah, oh, there it is. That's oh, always on the map. I should remember that. All right, cool. Yeah, I'm sorry. Sorry for not having a clue what I'm doing, but uh, you know, still learning, still learning. Let's have a look and see what we can do next. What's this? Oh, uh, we have already done that, right? Done that. Undiscovered location. Let's go. It's kind of back on ourselves a little bit, but it's cool. Die. These enemies now. A lot of friendlies around, which is kind of nice, I suppose. We're not just getting screwed out on the road straight away. So I'm playing this a day before release. Bethesda kindly hit me up with a code, which is very nice, very nice. But uh, I guess it's going to be like a day one patch or whatever. Screw it, we'll fight them another day. For now, let's keep going. Doesn't seem like it takes long to get around people. Oh shit. I've already done this, haven't I? Yeah. Oh, and the enemy of my enemy. I just got an achievement. Ready nerd. I kind of remember doing this stuff in the first raid, even though that was a long, long time ago. How far off is this place? Oh. Okay, okay, line this up, line this up. Don't screw this up, buddy. Let's go. Big boost. Quick side outlook. Fuck it. I'm going for it. Oh. I'm telling you, the trade mission would love to have that. Bandit dens are strongholds filled with enemies that eliminate eliminate all of the enemies. Okay, car's a bit screwed. If the Phoenix takes critical damage, you would need to exit and repair it at the front using focus. Okay. I'm checking into the clinic. Wait for me. Checking into the clinic, or got the waffle or something? I'm back, Walker. Phoenix is fixed. I'll be back. Could do with some more ammo, man. Can we sneak up on people? What's up, fam? Oh, how you doing? No armor for you. That's still got fucking armor. Overdrive. Missed. I did not miss. Need your health, thank you, thank you. So, I mean, is there a reason to hold on to the overdrive? Does it last longer or something when you get it? Uh, I guess it does, right? At the moment, it's times one. If you keep cranking it up, it's worth more. Get wrecked. Oh, she slammed into the wall. This game reminds me a little bit of Bullet Storm. Remember that game? A little bit like that. That's a bit glitchy. What's up, motherfuckers? I don't have any nades. I don't think. Nope. Ooh, boom. Need to be. Oh shit, mate. I'm reloading, mate. Give me a sec. I'm reloading. Oh, get wrecked. Need to look out for ammo, too. Take. Electrical component. So I guess I need to look out for stuff to pick up or something. Ah, oh, I wanted to use it on a. Blew off the edge anyway. Oh, Nate. Let's go. Yeah. You just do way more damage, don't you, in this mode? You do get help, so it's good to save it for a moment when you're screwed. Oh, look what I got, son. Oh. -ho -ho. Hell for me, thank you. Still more enemies though, right. I gotta be careful, man. Oh, it's like that, huh? Be 
you doing down here, mate? Am I collecting ammo off these guys? Ooh, so... Okay. Shit! Ah, oh, God. Hmm, so I've got to learn, like, what it is I can take and shit. I haven't got any secondaries. It's going to take me a minute to figure out exactly what I'm doing, you know what I mean? Any more enemies here? I don't like it, but... I mean, if I've cleared it, sh if I've cleared it, something should happen, I guess. So this is deeper into the enemy territory. Assault rifle round to the wind. She dead. Who else wants it? Didn't I attach this focus shit to like something else? Let's look at my binds again, but it's cool. I'll leave that till next time. I'm cool with using control for now. Oh. Good night. You got here for me, nothing. Aha, monies. Overdrive again, but I'm cool. Hmm. More enemies up here. Let's go. There's a lift. Okay. Oh, it's a very open world, man. We've just been dropped straight into it. It's not really much like go here, do this. It's not very linear. It's just like go and do what you fucking like by the looks of it. One thing I could use more of is grenades. I have none. Get ready. Big guy, big guy. I don't want to go away. Yeah, I still need to. I need to up my aim down sight sensitivity. It's way too low. Oh yeah, he's having a bad day. Can I take his gun? No. Alright, anything in here we can take? Look around for crates or whatever? Don't look like it, does it? So what about this door? I heard a beep. Not really seeing anything. What's going on up here? Oh, hello. Cute. Guess I need to look out for these crates then. Some junk, explosive components. Oh, arc chest. Open up. Nanotrite boosters are, uh, allow you to enhance your nanotrite abilities by upgrading them with perks in the nanotrite's menu. Arc chest shops and intel traders are the best sources for finding these. Okay, cool. I have zero, but now I have one, right? Ability upgrades. Nanotrite boosters are used to upgrade your nanotrite abilities. Visit the nanotrite's menu tab to purchase upgrades with nanotrite boosters and feltrite. So, where is that? You just told me that, mate. You've just told me that twice. Um, so... Here in the nanotrites menu, I'm guessing. Shatter. So I need the right amount of points. Okay, cool. You can view the perks. Um, oh no, I can get this one. Look, I can get one of these. Cooldown is reduced from 25 to 20. The warp range of shatter increases by 50%. Also, it sends me further forward. I feel like I might get this one first. We'll work on that one next time. Cool. Arc chests always contain valuable loot used to upgrade your nanotrite abilities, weapons, and yourself. Seek out more arc chests for more upgrade items. Upgrades for nanotrite abilities and weapons can be done in the menu. Okay, cool. Beautiful, beautiful. He just asked for something to shoot. Can I just drop off this, by the way, and not die? I kind of want that. Where are the more enemies over there? Sweet. 
so no, there's nothing in there. What's <laughs> up, bro? He did. I'm over here. Cheers, buddy. Pistol rounds, Matt. I, mean, I haven't really used the pistol that much. I feel like this assault rifle is kind of OP. Oh, God. That wasn't good. That wasn't that good at all. I think I might have to use uh, overdrive. Everybody give me your help. Thank you. Apparently I opened a container somehow. Just kind of battering people. I miss that? No, I think I got Everybody get rigged. Everyone's got so many grenades, but I have none. Must be able to craft them somehow, right? Money's... Oh, God. Should have used my dodge. Oh, well. Hmm. What are you doing over there? Alright, so where are there more enemies? Over that way, apparently. Yeah, here I am, let's fight. Coming to get you, mofos. Oh shit. Boom, get out of here. I'm learning. Supply crate smash. Thank you. What do you get? Medical components? Now, sometimes it's a little bit unclear what exactly you can pick up, but. I'm sure I'll learn eventually. I'm just sort of walking up to stuff and slapping pickup, you know what I mean? So, there's got to be more enemies here if this place is still going. Don't need the pistol rounds. So, is there, am I just. I'm literally just supposed to be killing all the enemies that are around here, right? And junk and stuff. At least now I know where my junk is coming from. So are these guys all dead yet, or what? I hear one. Here's some more. Over here somewhere. Oh! Triple kill! Oh, mate. This game's pretty bloody awesome at times. Doomsday peak sweep, we did it. Alright, that's all of them. Noise! I don't think I particularly had to do that just yet, but it's kind of cool that you can just sort of wander off and mess around. The outpost is cleared out. All the creeps are done crawling. We're back at base. Sweet. So, Lily hasn't actually got back to me, but whatever. Hmm. All right. So, is there anything else we can go and do? Let's have a look at the map. Cliffside Outlook, items of storage containers. So, what? That right there is solid ranger work. You're making Mama Prowley proud. Apparently I'm making Mama proud. So where are those containers? Let's grab a look at that. Activating. I track them apparently, but I don't know if I'm heading towards them or not. GPS even helping me out with this, and how in the frick do I get out of here? Whoa, camera's weird, camera's weird. I don't know if I want to go this way, dudes. I don't really want to exit the vehicle, just kind of want to find my way out. Oh, there's road, I see road. Let's go that way. Maybe I should just drive off the cliff and be out of this tight little area. There we go. That'll do, mates. Let's go. Ugh. More over the road. I feel like I want to remap boost from shift. Oh, damn it. You, when you use the boost, man, you just fly off the road. Uh, which way? This way? Okay. Skid it. 
How long does the boost? Oh, you've got the boost meter at the bottom there. I see it now. I see it. Die. Is that another roadblock? I mean, yeah, that one's done. Is that the one I keep passing? It must be. Yeah, man, look at that. It's so hard to control when you're boosting. Okay, I'm guessing over time we'll get better cars and stuff. So, wait. It's told me to get storage containers. Destination reached. Right here. Let's have a look. Saw a storage container just in front of me, but give me a sec. Smash open this ammo crate, why not? Is this what he was talking about? Aha. Uh -huh. So do I get points for like completing areas or whatever? There was still one more back there as well. Ah look, that's, this is the safe way in. In case you didn't want to fucking hit that ramp like I did. Or maybe you ain't got the car with you or something. So there's another one in here. No, 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 no. In there. Oh, come on. Alright, bomb level. Yeah, bye. Hey, location completed. So do I get some extra points for that or something? What's up with this? Is this Fortnite? What the shit? <laughs> Where did that end up? Damn. Let's go get the car. I wonder if, like, if you like, kind of jump off the cliff or whatever in the car, does the car take the damage, not you, and you just repair it? Oh, I'm getting interrupted. Apologies. Sorry if you got some weird pop up on the screen there. I'll try my best to edit that out. I might have a black screen for a couple of seconds. PC problems, you know what I'm saying? PC's like, I kept this out of the way and disturbed you with a big pop up. Yeah, car got wrecked. Safe mode engaged. Manual repairs needed. Systems regenerating. Yes, my focus button is mapped to seven on my mouse. Twelve buttons for the win, is all I'm going to say. Systems fully restored. Damn right they are. Good luck um, out there. So where's that junk crate? Or that crate? Oh, there it is. What was in there then? What the fuck was the point in that? I have no idea. What is this? That's something we've already done. Uh, so man, you just you, yeah, you just like roam about and do things. I guess you've just got to drive around and try and find stuff to do. But this would be the first objective, and like you can just go and get more upgrades or go and move towards this mission. I'm kind of glad that we've done a mission and done some side stuff. But you can see we've got to get quite far to go and get stuff done. That's one of them. So I guess the next thing we should do is start moving over to this right here. Um, where's the car at? Let's go. Up in the car, start going up towards that. But uh, I might save that for next time because I've been going for coming close to an hour. No loading speeds in this game, you. Yeah. So let's do a little bit of the driving towards it because it seems like it's quite far away. Is there anything in between us and that? Yeah, we could go and do this arc. We get to this arc, and we'll go and do that next video. But I'll get there this video. That game's pretty fun. The combat's really fun. I'm not sure how I feel about riding around in the desert all the time. I mean, it, I suppose it depends how much time exactly we're spending doing this. You know what I mean? Mechanics feel pretty smooth. It's running quite nicely on the PC. I've got stuff on high settings, not ultra, because I don't really feel like my PC can handle it. Although I haven't tried, it doesn't really bother me. Again, I'm only really trying to run the game at 60 FPS for YouTube, so it doesn't bother me if it goes to 144 or 240, so, but... there's a big well, tower over 9, standing here. It's got authority written all over it. Okay, chill out. Let me look around. Authority Sentry, where? Oh, it's behind that building. Alright, cool, we'll do that. Let's go take a look. Screw it, we'll do it now. Why not, right? Standby mode initiated. Right, 
It's taking damage at least. I ain't got a lot of ammo though, man. Ow. Might have to use my overdrive just to get health back. Yeah. I'm gonna need ammo to fight this thing, man. I mean, it did take a bit of damage when I shot it, but ammo is definitely a problem right now. Here we go. I've got pistol bullets, huh? Could always use those. We just rinse the pistol for a bit. Oh man, it fucking destroyed me. I guess maybe I've got to get a little bit more healthy before I fight that thing. And also, this is good because it sort of lets me know where I spawn, I guess. Ah, oh, quite close. Let's give it one more go. Let's get out of the car. Come back soon, Walker. Okay, I figured this out. I wonder what we get for doing this. Easy. This thing has no clue what's going on. Kill it. What's it doing? Switches up the strats when that happens. It's not cool. It's got different attacks. Well, that's pretty cool. Hip! It jumped. Hip! Take turrets live. Oh! Got him. Three sentry. Nice, we got some extra money for that. Beautiful. So I need to find like a one of those junk guys to sell some stuff to. Air tech core. A rare arc tech core. Bring to Cyberduck in Wellspring to augment yourself. Arc test intel traders. Authority sentries and junk mix are the best sources for finding these. Okay, cool. Good to know, good to know. Big ass towers out of commission. Great. They got some precious old world tech in them usually. Salvage what you can. Alright, let's have a look then. And I got something. I guess... Can we open these doors? No. So I guess the things we need are either going to be in these storage crates, or... on top Space of the buildings, the maybe? It's a meteor, dummy. Probably a shard of Apophis. Could be Feltrite to gain. Check it out. Alright, well now you know... Lots of upgrades and stuff, man. Thank you. It's good to check out some of the side stuff. Because I know I won't be doing all of it, but it's good to check it out. So if I can find the other two of these storage containers, and that means this location's complete, I think. Alright. Let's go, go, go. Hmm. See if I can spot any from up here. There's some stuff over there. Oh wait, this thing's got a burst mechanic? Oh, so if you just... If you don't hard aim... Then you get a... Uh, sort of a burst. That's pretty cool. I need assault rifle ammo, man. Oh, crap. How do I get up there, then? Eh. Hmm, oh, there's the ladder. Let's use that shit. Get up there. Get up there, you... Where's the container? Got a health infusion, that's always helpful. More feltrite. Hmm. I'm missing things. We don't like missing things around here. We've got loads of stuff to smash though. Oh, 
Very nice, very nice. Let's check this little building. I'm not seeing any more supply containers. How many did it say there were here? Two or three? Hmm. We already checked up there, didn't we? What are you fuckers doing? Are you ready? That one just exploded. I got a mutant spore, whatever the hell that is. I'll take it, whatever. GG, man. Let's see if I can get on top of these buildings. I, th I think I might have already looked on them, though. Let's go. I'm not seeing any more supply containers. I've got a good view up here, too. Ah, well. I might just leave it. It's taking me too long to find them. God knows where the other ones are, man. Hmm, wonder what's up there. Let's go have a look up there and then we'll call it a day looking for these things because I'm spending too much time looking for them. I've been here for like 10 minutes. There's some ammo crates over there that I can see. How do I get onto that? Oh, God damn it. Can't get up there. Can't jump very high at the moment. I guess that's going to be an upgrade though. Gotta be a way up onto this building. Here we go. This looks promising. Pretty confident that I've found all of the ammo around here, mate. And there's another one look. Still one more somewhere, but oh, there it is. Nice. Okay, cool. Done and done. Location complete. Beautiful. Let's get back to the car. I don't seem to take damage from falling, which is nice. Okay. Car. Oh, my shit's still marked. It is. Let's go to the location that I marked, and then I'll hop off. Here. Let's go. I feel like I want to rebind boost or something else on my mouse. How far off is this? Why did it let me target that? It's just a car. Oh man, the colours have changed. One of the complaints a lot of people had about Rage 1 is the colours in the game. Lots of... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Looks like a... Uh, Got different colours in this game, everybody. But pink and blue. Ooh, Roblox. We're here, sport. Oh, this is it. This is the arc. All right, cool. So I wanted to do this next time, so I'll leave this paused for now. Let me drop a quick save. New slot, beautiful. Hopefully, that's sort of like a save anywhere sort of feature, so it will load me right here. But much love for watching, everybody. I really do appreciate it. Let me know what you thought of the game in the comment section if you can. Uh, if you want to show a little bit of extra support to me, just drop a like on the video, share it wherever you can, all that good stuff. Have a great day, and until next time, take it easy.